Indeed, uh, one of the few things that that stuck, really struck me is something that would never be written about today. They talked about your physical appearance in a lot of the news stories, either as attractive or, you know, different things, which, you know, you wouldn't see in, in, in a clip today. In, how did you feel about that at the time? I mean, was, it, was it sexist? Or? No, I didn't think it was sexist, you know. I, 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 it didn't register with me at the time. I think if I look back and, and just say I looked at clips, I'd probably, that might stand out. Then I'd feel really flattered. Did I look that good back then? <laughs> yeah. uh, but, uh, no, it, it just, uh, I never took news stories personally. And I always felt the reporters had their job to do, and most of them were fair. Just, you know, like I treated the other legislators. And I never, uh, way back before I forgot in office, there was a little, he's long dead now, so I don't have to worry about the, the fame. And there was a little weekly rag that was put out here, very political in this area. And he, most of us were Democrats. I think his name was Doug Vedra. And uh, he could just tear you a new one in the press, you know. But I thought, boy, Doug's going to really get after me. But um, he actually came on and endorsed me for elections. So, now, I never, I had a real good relationship with the press, and I was never critical of what they did or, or said. Uh, and so those things just, whatever, just spell my name right, you know, talk about the good things I do. <laughs>